Kevin Harrington is my name, uh, principal at St. Lauren College. I've um, been principal here now for just coming on 18 months. Uh, prior to that, I've been teaching here, oh God, nearly 20 years at this stage, so well, well used to teaching here. Um, so the college itself, now St. Lauren College of Further Education, it's a small college, but we kind of specialise in certain subject areas. Uh, we kind of specialise in art, photography, all the media area, journalism, media uh, production, um, we also do photography and a very popular course recently now is multimedia and we've done a lot of work on that and we have a level 5 course and a level 6 course in multimedia. Great. Um, now in terms of kind of progression routes from the multimedia course, um, a lot of the students who do the level 5 course, some of them will work in kind of entry level positions in industry. But a lot of the people would progress to a level six course, or some of the other people as well would maybe aim to get into degree courses in perhaps Dunleary or Tala or DCU as well have a very good multimedia degree course. So some students in the past have gone gone there. So as I say, it's a very very popular course, and it's a course that is going to run in conjunction with an organisation called the Fast Track to Information Technology, and they have identified uh, kind of key areas that there are skills gaps in at the moment. They work with industry, so they work with the likes of Microsoft and Google and those big technology companies are in Dublin at the moment. And they, they work with those companies to identify the areas that they would like to train up, uh, particularly unemployed students. Uh, and they identify kind of multimedia, animation, games, those areas as areas that have skills gaps. So that's why we're focusing on those at the moment. Mm, in terms of employment, maybe about a quarter to a third would hope to kind of get direct employment. Right. But the majority of students, particularly from the level five, they would be looking to progress into kind it's of further third level. To a third level. Right. Some of the level six students, they would have more skills and they would be hoping, I'm sure, to kind of progress in directly into industry. But we're very, like, very lucky with our location because it's very central. Uh, we're just across from the Stillorgan Shopping Centre. We have pretty much everything you would need on our doorstep. We have a full range of restaurants, cafes, pubs, uh, sporting facilities, bowling alleys and so on. So they're all in the Salorga village. And then in terms of transport, again, we're very well served. We would have uh, quite frequent bus routes. We would have the 46A, we would have the 47, we have the 145. They're all passing by quite frequently. And then also uh, for students who want to take the Lewis, we're about a 15, 20 minute walk away from the Green Line. And about the same distance as well from the Black Rock Dart Station. So now some students coming from the north side they oh, come along and they get off at black rock and they either walk the up or yeah. get the bus the 17 yeah. bus as well yeah. so yeah. we don't actually have a library in the premises and the building itself but we're a very short distance away from still organ branch library and they're very well equipped and they have good facilities there and we work very closely with them as well a lot of the students will go over there uh, it's only three minute walk away and if they have some free time and they want to do some research there's Wi-Fi over there as well, so they would do a lot of their projects over there. So um, it's a very good relationship there between the college and the local library. We have a website, which is stillorgancollege.ie, and it has a full range of information about the college and our resources, and especially the courses. And if students are interested in applying for any of the courses we have on offer, the application is done online through our website. It um, will probably start recruiting again towards the end of January, early February every year. So if students are interested, if kind of January, February, uh, if they just go onto the website, and uh, very simply just fill out the, their details in the application and then we will contact them with a follow-up. Usually what we would do is we'd invite the student to come in and sit down with them and talk about their options and why they'd like to do the course. Uh, for some of the practical subjects like art or photography, we would request that the students would bring in a very simple portfolio just to demonstrate that they have the ability and the aptitude to do the course. But uh, in terms of students and getting on the courses, it's a very open policy. So as long as a student has interest and an aptitude for the course, we are delighted to have them.